And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and sharing duties with me today, Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's Al Nasser against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. So here is the lineup. Anderson Talisca plays alongside Luis Gustavo in the centre of midfield. And the starting role in attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. And here's how the lineup looks for PSG. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Marquinhos plays with Sergio Ramos at the back. Fabian plays alongside Marco Verratti in the engine room. And in attack today, Kylian Mbappe starts with Lionel Messi. And this confrontation is underway. Al Khaybari. Opportunity it is. Taliska! Well, the shot seemed like a good option, but goalkeeper's ball. Fabian. Here's Mbappe. And he read it well, intercepting it. Anderson Taliska. Given his magnificent... Hang on, Derek, it's a chance here. Oh, not to be. An opportunity wasted early in the game. Well, maybe it's come a little bit too early, Derek. But that's a wasteful finish. Bernat. Mbappe with it. Messi. Vitor Pereira. Good use of advantage in favour of PSG. Can he find the net? And foiled only by the crossbar. And they could face difficulties here. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Al Khanam. It's with Anderson Tariska. And that's an important intervention. Messi. Fine run from Mbappe. And Messi! Well, what a stop that was. A short corner here. And the advantage is with PSG. And blocked for now. And he's gone into an illegal position, unfortunately. Ziyech. Oh, in with a chance! And still danger here! Not a time for composure on the ball. Well, you sense it's just a matter of time before they do score, Derek. They've been piling on the pressure now and really should be ahead in this one. Yes, end-to-end -end stuff, but now they're forced to track back. Mbappe? Oh, it might be! Oh, a great chance it was! 
Goalkeeper has it. Plenty of support here. But they took care of the situation defensively. Ziyech. Oh, good save. How about the short corner? Oh, a fine block. Anderson Taliska. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And a fantastic diving save. Playing it short. Ronaldo at the ready. Giving it a try. And the keeper more than equal to it. Elects to go short. Teammates in the middle. Oh, yes! What a classy goal! And make no mistake, there aren't many in the game who would have the confidence to even try it. Well, here it is again, and all you can do is admire the skill. That's a really clever goal, you have to say. PSG get the ball moving again. How will they respond? Well, not the pass he had in mind. Messi. He's in here. It has to be, surely. Well, it certainly was a bold attempt. Good to see him try his luck with the chip. Well, it's a great attempt. Opts to lift it over the keeper. Just gets a little bit too much on it. Messi. Lionel Messi. Than that. Oh, maybe the equaliser. Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. And options in the centre. This could be the equaliser. Oh, but he's missed it. He's completely failed the test. Well, that was a big opportunity, and they really should be level now. They have to be more clinical in front of goal. Anderson Taliska. That's an effective cross aimed at the back post. Well, in fact, a bit too close to the goalkeeper, and that was always going to be claimed. Kylian Mbappe. Well, failure to keep the ball there by Paris Saint Germain. Anderson Taliska, it should be, and a goal by Cristiano Ronaldo, so typical of him.
Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And I have to say, the finish from Ronaldo is just brilliant. He's such a good technician. It's a wonderful goal. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Lionel Messi. Ferreira. Running with the ball confidently. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Ziyech. No possibilities in the centre. Giving them a different option by moving in field. And a really powerful effort, but just over the top. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. And a good-looking ball. A chance to eat into their lead. Oh, she's given it. The referee says penalty. Now, can they reduce the arrears from the spot? And the referee will take his name as well. Yeah, it was a poor challenge. And the referee is absolutely right to take his name. This to pull one back. And in it goes, as coolly as you like. Never in any doubt from the spot. Well, here it is again. And just watch the keeper. He stands still, hoping it's hit down the middle. Unfortunately for him, he's got it wrong. The whistle then, we're up the halfway stage in this match. Well, we're focusing on Cristiano Ronaldo for a reason, Stuart. Fair to say, he's been at his brilliant best. Yeah, what a performance he's putting in here. Great movement, lots of energy and a very good finish for his goal. He's been excellent. Fine run from Mbappe. Well, the ball is moving again, and work to do for Paris Saint-Germain in the second half. Determined defending. Useful looking ball. Well, nearly shaving the crossbar with that powerful effort. Take this on. Oh, good reflexes from the keeper and the danger averted. <laughs> Who's going to get on the end of it? And foiled by the post. Prepared to take on the shot. Superb block. Marquinhos. Well, had that gone in, the game was firmly in their hands. Now, though, they've got to make sure they don't let this slip. And it's with Luis Gustavo here. Good tackle. Could be a chance to break here. And having already received a yellow card, he's walking a very fine line. And it has been deemed a second bookable offence. His day is done, Stuart. Well, if I was the coach, I'd have taken him off earlier. This always looked likely to happen. Substitution it is for PSG.
Mbappe. Now with Fabian. And return to Mbappe. And the keeper making sure that there were no scraps to feed on for the attackers. And PSG come away with it. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, it petered out. And the pass could do damage. Chance, maybe. And the keeper put to the test, but he comes through it. Well, he's so sharp, isn't he? Great first save, and then the recovery. Cristiano Ronaldo. Promising attack, this. Oh, they've won the ball back quickly. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, here it is again. And it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions. But you do have to ask questions of the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't be beaten at your near post like that. So back underway, 3-1 the score. Oh, fancy footwork. And the PSG corner. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Now the delivery. Now can they counter clinically? Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Mbappe. Oh, just narrowly off target. Well, they broke with such pace and intent. Fantastic move. Just couldn't quite cap it off. And time for the change now. Ali Al Hassan. Really good interception. And they could face difficulties here. Couldn't quite hang on. And Ronaldo Sanchez with it now. Chance to make a game of it here. Mbappe. Big chance. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Kick played in. Well, the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. The referee is given a corner. Well, they're going for the short one. Benassi. And quite simply, a wonderful chance was squandered. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Still could be dangerous. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Marco Verratti. Mbappe with it. And green space galore for PSG. Mbappe! A goal! Just what they needed. Still plenty of life in this match. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal.
And away they go once more. And plenty still for Paris Saint-Germain to fire at in this game. Cristiano Ronaldo. Nicely timed tackle. Messi. Time is against PSG, but they still have the ability to hit back. And hammered in there. Well, here it is again. The cross is inch perfect, just begging somebody to run onto it. And what a clever bit of play it was from Messi, both with his movement and his finish. That's a nice goal. Either side shy about shooting in this match. Determined defending. Eki Tike. Still pushing for what could be a winner. Soler. Fabian! Well, I think it's fair to say he really should have been able to give the keeper a test from there. Soler takes the shot and not cleared away properly. Well, this forthcoming corner might just do it. Could be their last chance to hit the front in the dying moments. Now sending it in. Can they forge ahead? Excellent block. Might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Oh, the goal! Who would have predicted this after the sending off? They have the lead now. Incredible. minimum of four added minutes PSG simply must be opportunistic with but it stopped a promising attack in its tracks and you wouldn't be surprised if there's a card coming out here but it is a caution and stay calm might be the instructions that should come from the manager yeah you're absolutely right if they're not careful they're gonna lose another player fairly soon Straight into the meat of the penalty area. Losing custody of it, Conte. Soler. Really nice ball. Fabian. Fabian! And it's a goal for Paris Saint-Germain to square this game. Let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure, but he's still got so much work to do. Just look at the strength he shows to hold off the defender and still get his shot away. That's a really good finish. That is that after 90 minutes. They are level and extra time is coming up.
Understandable that fatigue might set in. A strength-sapping night for all concerned as the first period of extra time begins. Al Amri is with Hakim Ziyech. Chances on, and a long way out here. Oh, and in! This is a remarkable turnaround. Down to ten, but now in the lead. Who saw that coming? Well, here it is again, and they've taken their goal well, but the defending was non-existent. That should never happen. say I'd have to go back quite a few years to remember the last time I covered a game with a scoreline of 5-4 Soler defensive Brazilians to shut them down Ziyech well they're on the scent of something positive and through for the goal kick he hit it with power Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh, a good diving save. That's a short corner. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Disappointingly, straight into the wall. So following the deflection, a corner kick coming up here. But he's gone short with it. Cross fired over. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Renato Sanchez. Can they hit on the break? Defenders need to cover. Using his strength to shield the ball. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. pass not quite accurate enough and a throw in then Cristiano Ronaldo and now passing it through majestic piece of goalkeeping well he loves the big moments doesn't he and he's proved it again there great goalkeeping Now sending it in, and still dangerous.
Well, that's it for the first period of extra time. Let's see what the second has in store. And so the drama continues here. We're into the second period of extra time. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. PSG looking dangerous. Now can they create something? The attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. He's in here. And a shooting chance for Conte. And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender's just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, but should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. So a throw in for PSG. Can he get one back? Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Trying to deliver it accurately. Soler, is this the moment? Oh, did so well to deny him. Can someone get on the end of this? No real challenge for the goalkeeper. An awful lot of green space to run into. Oh, good work by the keeper. Over it comes. Well, the keeper made that look relatively easy. In truth, it wasn't. He's in behind. A goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat-trick. Well, as you can see, the defending is all over the place. That's far too easy for the attackers. The goalkeeper's got absolutely no chance there. And we're underway again. This game very much over as a contest. Well, if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. And Ronaldo Sanchez with it now. And the referee says enough is enough. That's the end of the game. It's a defeat for PSG. Your assessment. Well, Derek, the fans are right to expect more. The tempo of their passing was too slow. They were second to the ball too many times and were beaten by the better side today.